mythology is full of tales that inspire awe and wonder. The tale I am about to share is one such story. The story of Goddess Durga. Once upon a time, there was a tyrant called Mahishasur. He was part demon and part buffalo. Mahishasur meditated for thousands of years so he could please Lord Brahma and in return be blessed with immortality and power. After much penance, his plan worked. Lord Brahma came to him and said, I am very pleased with your devotion. Ask me any boon that you desire. Without batting an eyelid, the arrogant Mahishasur said, Lord, I don't want any man or god to be able to kill me. Brahma raised his hand in blessing and said, Tathastu, so be it, my child. A twinkle in Brahma's eyes gave away the fact that maybe Mahishasur had left a loophole while seeking his blessing. Time would tell. Armed with this boon, Mahishasur considered himself immortal as no man or god could lay hands on him. In his rage and pride, he practically destroyed the earth. The lands were soon covered in darkness and his massacres were widespread. Not only that, he chased away the gods out of heaven. Scared, the gods went running to Brahma, Vishnu and Shiva and narrated their misfortune. The lords Brahma, Vishnu and Shiva were hopping mad. They conferred for a moment and then they held each other and started to radiate a blinding light, a light never seen before. Out of this beautiful light was born the ten-armed goddess Durga, the embodiment of Adi Shakti. One by one, the gods approached her and gifted her a dazzling array of weapons. The mighty Sudarshan Chakra was given to her by Lord Vishnu. She got a Kamandal or pitcher from Lord Brahma. She got a quiver full of arrows from Lord Varuna, the god of the sea. Lord Yama, the god of death, gave her a powerful scepter. Lord Indra, a thunderbolt to rattle the earth. Lord Vishwakarma, a menacing axe. Kal, or time, gave her a sharp sword. Eravata, Indra's white elephant, gave Goddess Durga a bell. Its noise helped her confuse the demons. Lord Shiva gave her a dangerous trident. The mighty Himalayas gave Goddess Durga a lion to ride upon. Armed with ten weapons, gifted to her by the gods, one for each arm, she looked ready to show Mahishasura who the boss was and went into battle with him. battled Mahishasur for 10 whole days. On the 10th day, she managed to chop off his head with her trident. At last, the balance of life was restored. To celebrate this victory, we performed Durga Puja every year. Durga Puja is a 10-day carnival in Bengal. Day is also called the Shera and we celebrate Lord Ram killing Ravan too. <laughs>